Hello and welcome to my extra live stream for um, Children's Miracle Networks Hospitals. And for, I mean, this is my first year of actually participating in um, Extra Life. And you can see the links which are at the bottom of my screen here um, and in my Twitch channel profile page, uh, which have all the links to donate and to find out more about what what I'm doing it for and what the uh, team's doing it for. Um, I'm, I'm part of the Team Tomb Raider which is uh, a group which is hosted by uh, Stella um, who I'm sure many of you have used her walkthrough guides and stuff. Um, it's like absolutely fantastic spirit within the community and um, it's like very very positive and kind of created this group and it's been doing it for a few years and this year I've decided to actually join the team and uh, help represent. Um, and what I'm going to be doing is my... I kind of collected together or composed what I would maybe consider to be my top 10 tombs and levels uh, within the Tomb Raider series. And it was one of the hard, like really, really hard to kind of narrow down uh, like the top 10. I'm kind of having an iron with some of the uh, some of the one entries that I put in, but from the list that I made it a little while back, I'm going to be playing these through, um, and I'm going to start at number ten, which is West Africa in Ghana um, on Tomb Raider Legend. Hopefully, this is uh, coming through okay, and I have a webcam this time. I don't know if the audio is syncing correctly, but um, we'll find out. Um, I'm just going to pop out a tweet to say I'm now live. Um, so people can jump in if they want to. Um, if you follow Stella's site, uh, Stella's uh, Twitch channel, which is Stella Tomb Raider, forward slash Stella Tomb Raider, uh, she's going to be hosting channels throughout the Extra Life weekend. There's a bit of a schedule going on. Uh, I did my piece last night, which uh, we had really good fun with Rise of the Tomb Raiders Endurance Mode. I did that on co-op for the first time with uh, with John, and uh, the video is up on my YouTube channel. It was it was a real laugh. It was it was so much fun to play. Um, and I'm, I hope to do more of that like in the uh, coming weeks and stuff. Uh, so let me just put out this tweet. Um, now live. But yes, um, I, with regards to donating to Extra Life, I mean, even if it's just sharing the page, I really appreciate any um, donations or tweet, Facebook shares, or whatever. Um, either for mine, or if you, if you prefer to support a another um, children's, children's Miracle Network hospital that one of the other team members are doing, just donate to them. I mean, it all goes towards the uh, the team total at the end anyway. So. Close up this one and commence. So, right. The version I'm playing is the PlayStation 3 HD trilogy, and it's one of my favourite versions of the game. I originally had Legend back on PlayStation 2, and then upgraded on the Xbox 360 and then I, when I got a PlayStation 3 which I got after my 360 I, I picked up this version. Let's pick an outfit to use. Um, one that's kind of suitable. I haven't unlocked them all by the looks of things. I'm thinking to go for a bit of a classic look. As long as it's not classic lot. Yeah there we go. On my screen, the colours look a little off. I'm not sure about uh, for you guys. Right. Let's continue. And let's pop 
that in there. Hey Kelly, I just threw my chat up. <laughs> I'm just uh, flicking between my screens, so I only just saw your comment. Um, no sign of Rutland so far. Have we worked out what he's doing here? No, but there's something else. When I was going over the map, Winston said your parents have been there. Your dad worked the site before you were born. That's not so peculiar. It happens occasionally. Now, one of the reasons for me picking Ghana, um, and it's the same with another entry of my list actually, is the fact that the landscape is just so amazing. Um, I remember playing this on um, to, uh, when I got it. I'm this waterfall. I mean, look at that. If all else fails, I can get into the postcard business. Oh, now look at the little termites mucking it all up. That won't do at all. Looks like they didn't get in from this side. Any ideas? We'll see. I do my best thinking tumbling off cliffs. I quite agree with you, Kelly. I, um... I've loved all of the um, the classic voices as well, but I think um, Keeley kind of really nailed it in this in this and had a really good voice direction and everything. Really had the spirit of Lara Croft in her voice and kind of kind of missed that. So I, won't, I mean, I'm not going to be going for any secrets and stuff because I've picked everything up. So <laughs> we, we can just kind of crack on with the level. Um, and what I'm going to intend to do is, as I play through, I'm going to do five of my top ten today. Um, so spread out during the course of today. And then I'm going to do the next five tomorrow. There's a real mix of, um, oh crap, there's a real mix of like classic and um, Crystal Trilogy stuff in here. I didn't put any of the uh, the new games in. While I absolutely love them, it's really hard to kind of break down um, specific tombs and levels and they've not really been out long enough for, um, oh. not really been long, out long enough for me to really kind of stick them into my top 10. Oh, that's where we put the temple. Ground entrances are always impractical. It's what makes them grand. So this is Lara. an example of one of the things I really love beaver, about this level. Oh, it's look. just... It's okay, Rutland. not this. Fancy not Rutland, dropping but... down for a chat then? Only if you can shoot this far. You know long distance relationships inevitably come to I miss the wit. I'd wish you luck with that, but, uh, you know. I miss that character. Alistair should really have a look at this. Well, he's still trying to figure out where these sword pieces originally came from. Just you and me for now. I remember being I've seen this before. And I've been really skeptical about skeptical. this game. He has been here. Cause um just after um
Yeah, just after Angel right. of Darkness. It wasn't rattling. He's still about somewhere. I was kind of unsure where the direction huh. of the game was going to go. Not very go. effective for a trap. Not these days. Something must be jamming the works. Oh yeah, this is one where you can get acrobatic. I didn't like so much about this was so many uh, like enemies like this. <laughs> Jump on his head. Um, this water wheel appears to be jammed. We might never know what it does. That pillar looks too heavy to move. There's more than one way to put a There is, Lara. There is. puzzle already. <laughs> hey Stella. Oh here we go, there's the rope. That's the one I wanted. At least in general the rope um, rope swinging in this is a little bit better than anniversary. Well anniversary had the issue with the um, the side swinging one which is a real pain in the butt water wheels got things running again hey, that's fine congratulations you got your wish the place is a death trap they needed a woman's touch i'm assuming uh let me just check on my stream I'm hoping the chat pops up on the um on my screen because i've got it set to do so if not i'll have to uh work it out So much light. Swing, swing, swing. Should have just moved on to the next one. So like, aren't your arms tired, Lara? What?
swing. here oh yeah third time lucky yeah indeed <laughs> so early for you Stella so dedicated which is awesome I mean I was up at nine oh jeez I was up at nine and then I was um, just running tests on uh, my OBS just to make sure that everything was going to come out okay. This channel runs directly down to the wheel. Can't have a wheel without a couple thousand gallons of water. No, it's simply not done. No. wasn't a real one, he just faded away, he's like, I, I think, see, because the enemies just fade away like that, I have a feeling that Lara Croft's just hallucinating and it's all just one big nightmare, it's not really happening. Looks good to me. Seems to be two chat overlays. That oh, actually, yeah, there might be. Um, let me get rid of the other one because I accidentally uh, I, I made one bigger and I accidentally forgot to delete the second one. <laughs> um, that one. Yes. Right. So there we go. We got a good one now because I wanted a bigger um, thing. See, I can imagine that um, for anyone that's played um, Dreamfall, where she's just kind of just in bed um, in a coma and everything is like kind of happening in the subconscious mind, maybe that's happening to Lara. is what she wants to see. Okay, so I'm up here now. Let's drag you over here. I like the puzzle in this level as well as that um, the absolutely fantastic intro um, with the waterfall. Just wanted to make sure that I didn't have my volume on the other thing. No, oh, oh, you numpty. Numpty craft. It's slowly moving its way back up. 
Yeah, so everything, so basically, um, she had that issue in the uh, pyramid. They found her, she's been in a coma ever since. It's, it's a sad and horrible time for Miss Croft. Not the Tom Hanks kind. Yeah, I could do it that way. She seems to have a bit more of a tan in this one, in this HD version. But from the places that she goes to, I'm not in the slightest bit surprised. Stand on here and hope I don't fall down the floor, down onto the floor. Okay, take care. Like that. What a goof. Thankfully this level's forgiving and uh, gives me that little box. Ouch. <laughs> I think I'm gonna save my time and um, wait until it's When I see a lot of negativity, um, you know, so many times with regards to the Crystal Trilogy, um, the, uh, that, the first trilogy that they did, which had um, Keely Hawes and um, features the, you know, some near classic style Lara. Um, but I think they're, I think they're great games. They, you know, they, they're good fun. Um, they're different to the originals, obviously, but they have their own uh, their own credit. And I'm not a hater of the uh, reboot se series either. I mean, maybe there's a little bit, you know, not as much like um, you know, fondness of Lara Croft. Be interested to see what happens to her next, but. Um, more a case that um, more a case that she's kind of lost you know, her character. You scare me. You may want to close your eyes. Then. Ah. I mean, she's 
stuff. But there are certain elements where she's still got a bit of Lara in her, like Lara as we all know her in her. But um, she's lost a lot of character. A lot of this Lara kind of takes from the movie Lara. <laughs> Little quotes like that. What is it? You hear something? I feel something. Oh no, this. Oh hell I hate, no! I, I hate this because of the camera angle. It kind of throw. It kind of puts you in the wrong camera angle. <laughs> It was definitely too short. Um, and I vaguely remember issues with the 360 version. But then it played better than the uh, PlayStation 2 version, so. What is it? You hear something? I feel something. I mean, just looking at the um, the puzzle structure, the uh, the beauty of the level, and everything else, it's like you can see why this crept into my top ten. This shouldn't be here. Oh, dearest Amelia, yours always. 
Richard. It was Mother's. Zip, can you hear me? Where are you? Flashlight time. don't like so much. I always debate whether they're too high or not because getting so used to the current uh, Tomb Raider game and things which look like they're the right height to be able to jump up to, can't. Uncharted does that as well. There are things which are ridiculously um, you know, not too far a jump. of that lovely acrobatic skill and everything and I just fall. Damn. But I just know about that bridge if you uh, try to cross the bridge. Then they're going to throw grenades at you. And that's it. <laughs> that's, one, that's the one section on this level that I don't like. So, oh crap. Why didn't this go off of them?
let's get this swing right. Thanks for stopping by, Cuddy. Uh, I'll catch you later. Perfect. Pretend I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, you know, it's what puts the sword back together. It's the size of a fist. And according to Amanda's research, it's here. Ooh. What do you know about Amanda? Where is she? So, your, your father did some digging here, didn't he? You know, Amanda thought maybe he found the key. I don't know what you're talking about. Tell me about that sword fragment you're so fond of waving about. <laughs> well, I have been spending some time with it, and I've learned a couple of things. Yeah. Let me show you. Oh, crap. about this guy. Bet you wish you could do that, huh? Ready for this? Watch. Fine. We'll do it your way. Ready for this? Watch. Bet you wish you could do that, huh? pieces weren't broken apart. They were designed to separate and reattach. She looks filthy. The Galali key does that? Uh. I don't suppose you'd tell me where this came from. The Crusades? King Arthur? Uh, history doesn't interest me. Only power. Well, then why don't you stay here and consider the future? Make sure I'm not in it, however. You won't enjoy seeing me again. 
Your father might not have found the Galali key, but Amanda doesn't know that. She's at your mansion right now. You better have good insurance. So that is number 10 on my list, uh, so that's Ghana in West Africa. Uh, I am going to be back in a short while, I'm going to change over my game, update my live stream uh, stuff and go and export the video onto YouTube. So I will catch you guys in a short while for number 9 on my list. See you soon.